Hi, it's Russ from Pro Tools Expert, and I'd like to show you a review of Voice of God from Little Labs. Now, this is an interesting plugin. It might be worth you heading across first to the UAD site and checking out the video there from the guy from Little Labs to explain its basic principle. And what it enables you to do is to get a, a low end frequency and to tune uh, instruments uh, from everything from voices all the way through to kick drums and bass guitars with uh, this really cool plugin. It's pretty straightforward. You have a an amplitude and you have a frequency and you have some center points and it's as simple as just tuning them and it may sound like well just isn't this just a bass boosting device or isn't this just a loudness control well in some ways it couldn't be further from the truth because what it en enables you to do is to find the resonance and then extenuate that resonance and it's very very cool and very very useful for example it allows you to work on tracks that are combined already take an entire mix and start tuning stuff within the mix. Or you could take solo instruments. So for example, uh, we're going to start with this bass guitar here, this grooving bass guitar. And I want to show you the part first, and I'm going to actually just mute that out and turn this on. And at the moment, I've got this bass guitar. Which on its own, it's not a bad recording. But what we have there is what I have, we have a lot of high and a lot of low. And we're missing the body of the guitar that we need to bring into it. So if I just turn that on, we can tune it. If I tune the right one to tune, choose. There's the original. Got some body in there now. And there's the amplitude control. Put some more in. Just dial it in. So if we now take that into the track again. There's the original. That will flant it there. We now have a bass guitar which sits much nicer in the track. Now what's really cool as well is we could turn it back off there. We can actually put it on the whole mix instead. So very nice indeed. Now what gets cool as well, if we take something like this, this loop here, turn it off first. Pretty cool funky groove. Now listen what I can do with the kick drum. I can tune the kick drum. Now you might want to put on either a pair of really good monitors or a pair of headphones, but... Take a very lo very loose kick drum. Get some real punch in there. If I want to get mad, I can really pun punch up the amplitude. Or, or lay it right back off. add some body into that kick drum. How cool is that? Very nice. Let's go to a completely different instrument now, because obviously there's going to be a kind of an assumption in some ways that this is just about bass. But let's take something, uh, you could use this on a voice, but I'm going to use a similar frequency. I'm going to take this uh, sax part that I've got here. And a lot of these are from Loop Loft samples, actually. These are demos from Loop Loft samples. And, and head over to his site because he does some really great sample stuff. So let's turn it off first. Nicely recorded. 
sax. But it's lacking a bit of body. Let's dial some in. We can just honk it up. Hear the body in there now. So very nice indeed. That there is sweet. Really get the amplitude right up. The kind of chest resonance. I'll so show you a final one. A whole mix. So this is a rock mix, kind of a pop rock track. So go further into the track a bit. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Glory, glory, and again, choose a frequency. Very subtle this time. Not really dialing much in at all. Not really dialing much in at all. Just lifting that bottom end up a bit. So nice in a mastering or a mix comp um, situation there. So go further on the song. Further into the song here, it goes goes a bit quieter. And the bass guitar's in there. There we go. Just really rounding out that bottom end. So there we are, very various uses of it. So it's a really cool plugin. And again, one of those unique plugins, one thing I love about UAD is sometimes they do a plugin and you might think, well, why would I use that? But it's it's one of those plugins that nothing else can do. And yes, you could probably try and use EQ units and try and notch it and use kind of variable cues on it, but it's not going to give you the kind of results that Little Lab's um, Voice of God does. So I think it's a great plugin, and I give it a big thumbs up, and it's well worth trying the demo if you're a UAD user and trying it on various sources, as I say, to bring uh, stuff back to life and to add energy into it, and as I say, retune kick drums, retune a voice and give it some body, uh, saxophones, brass, uh, all sorts of stuff. I've shown you on various source materials. So it's a, I would say if you are interested in adding some body and some uh, some density to a track, then check out Voice of God from Little Labs on the UAD site. Well worth thinking about. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon.